What's up guys, this is Walid and today's problem is the boiling water. So we have water of weighs 1.2 kilograms, heat capacity, and initial temperature 29.3 Kelvin and boils at 37.3 Kelvin. Okay. So they're asking how much energy must be added to the water by heating it in order for it to go to, to the boiling point. So I'm going to do Q is going to equal to MC delta T, and then the mass is 1.1, and then the heat capacity 4186, and then the temperature is 373 minus 293, and then the heat to boil the water to reach to boiling point is 368368. Joules. Cool. And now in the second question, they said that now we have two things in the system. We have aluminium pot, and so they're asking, what's the energy required to make both the aluminium pot and the water um, to a boiling point? So we know how much energy we need to get the water to a boiling point. Three, six, eight. You just add 0.1 kilograms. Times the 900 from the from this guy, the uh, heat capacity, and then the energy to uh, the temperature 373 minus 293. Okay, when you add these guys together, you get 37.5568 joules. Cool. So now, if the water take 5.5 minutes to boil. Um, what should be the watts? What should be the power? Okay, so we know watts is equal to joules per second. Okay, so now it's just the way I think of it is just you know making units work to get joules per second. So now we have the total amount, which is thirty-seven five five six eight, and that's joules. So now we need seconds, and we have the time, which is five point five minutes. So we need to divide, so divide by 5.5 minutes, and then we change that to second because watts is per second, and then so it's 60 second divided by one minute. We cancel the minutes out, and then you answer the get is 1138. 8 joules per second or watt. Okay. So the second question and the fourth. Um, they took the water out and they're asking um, if there is only an air and the aluminium pot system, what's the final temperature? Assuming that the aluminium pot initial temperature is the boiling and the initial temperature for the air is 293 Kelvin. Simple problem, mass of AL times specific heat for AL, aluminium times delta T is equal to mass of the air times C air times delta T. Those guys, 1.1 Nine hundred thirty-seven three minus the final equal point two nine times one oh oh four specific heat for air t final minus two ninety three okay so just work the algebra out and then my answer was the t final is equal to two nine eight point two one Kelvin. Cool. So for this guy, I just solve for the t finals. It's just a math problem algebra. All right, guys. If you have any question, let me know. I'm trying to help. Good luck.